there is an increased demand for condoms. That's one. The other one was the bureaucracy in procuring uh, the condoms. So we thought we would be having uh, uh, condoms coming in as our condoms were getting finished. Because remember one thing, when you are having condoms in stock, they occupy a lot of space. So what happened was our condoms got used up very quickly and there was a delay in uh, procurement. So two things happened. Uh, the wrong things happened at the, at the right times, leading to uh, stock out of condoms. Well, it may be one person using it five times. <laughs> All right? So, are you getting me? It's not a question that it's all those people. It is one per certain groups will be using it every day, right? One person. Collaboration with uh, the UNFPA to supply us uh, about 180 million condoms. Now, they delivered about 19 million condoms in January that we have been able to distribute um, over the last one and a half months. Um, and then we are expecting a consignment that will be coming in from uh, May um, consistently, about 30 million condoms of el every month, consistently until August. But because of this, we've asked for an emergency procurement from PEPFA, from USAID, um, and they will be giving us 45 million condoms that is coming in on the 10th of April. I've procured vehicles um, that then and caravans that will be then available to transport these condoms to the interior. And we're also partnering with um, community-based organizations uh, to be able then to deliver those to the farthest um, in, terms of, um, in terms of distance. But we must appreciate that also delivering this requires an infrastructure that is already there. We know we have a geographical access. We need roads, we need uh, other systems in place, and those are the challenges that we face. And surely if one is able to pay a ticket to London or even to New York or even to Dubai, I don't think you can feel the pain if you put two more dollars or one to keep a child from being transmitted uh, AIDS from the mother. Uh, it makes sense to us.